about two years ago, I completed my 12 empowerments <clears throat> in Goa. And before that, I was, I was really seeking, I guess, relief from, from my experience. Everything that was constantly coming up, it would just cause so much confusion because it was so obvious that I, I didn't have the tools and, and support to really allow it to be as it is. And instead of being limited by it, um, well, I guess I, I was becoming limited by it rather than disempowered. And I'd engage in, lot, in lots of different practices like yoga and meditation and Western psychology and, you know, looking at all these different philosophies, really desperate to feel relief. And underneath all that, it was so obvious that I had this desire to be of benefit to all, but I didn't know how to enact my beneficial potency to really contribute that in the most open-hearted, sustainable way. Um, and then coming to Balanced View, it was the first time where I was given that complete permission field just to be exactly as I was. I could allow all the anxiety, all the fears, all the paranoia, everything that I was so desperate to, to get rid of, I could then allow that to be as it is. And, and what I saw really directly is that that was my fuel to be of benefit. It was the very thing that I was trying to change, trying to manipulate and turn into a different experience, which I was taught I wasn't supposed to feel those things. And by being around so many incredible people in the community, that reflected my amazingness. And, you know, I've always believed that we're, we're all born to be empowered, we're born to be beneficial. And when you're in an environment where that's the only thing that's reflected back at you, you can just thrive. And I really feel that that's what we all deserve as human beings. And I've been at the center for about two weeks now, just um, helping, helping setting up. And like I, I traveled for 30 hours from Australia to get here and I just came straight to the center to, to see all of you amazing people. Um, which is, which is the complete opposite to what I usually do. I feel I'm more inclined to, to get my energy from being alone, but when I'm around community, it's, it's the complete opposite. I'm totally uplifted and inspired and just driven to be of benefit. And working, working with so many amazing people, like I, I, I found myself in so many roles and positions that I never thought I'd be put in. And you know, instead of being put down or blamed and criticised, I'm completely empowered and, you know, everybody takes such great care to show me what to do and with unconditional love and patience. And I'm just so grateful for that because um, you, you really see what you're capable of and any limitation that I put on myself, um, I just, yeah, I see completely through it and I really do just see it as a data stream that doesn't have that, that power or control over me. So working together in teams in such synergy and harmony, harmony where, you know, benefit, respect and gratitude is the basis. So when everything's coming from that place, it's incredible what gets done in such a short period of time. And, you know, like, it's so obvious as well that now that I'm not worried about everything that's coming up in my experience, there's so much energy just to serve and, and be of benefit. And I'm so happy to do that. And like, I used to think that by doing that, I'd be giving my energy away or somehow I'd become depleted. But when that, when that emphasis shifts from my own self-concern, all that's left is this, I guess, desire to be of benefit. And it's just, it happens so effortlessly and in such an open-hearted way.